Hey guys, we're here taking a look at getting water up again. Now last time we looked at packagers and we discovered that it's 50 megawatts to get water up across a map anywhere with a packager. That includes the megawatts to run the extractor, two packagers, and one unpackager on the other end. All right, now today we're looking at water towers which previously i thought did not work but what i was doing wrong is with your key pipe or your priming pipe whatever you want to call it and you do want to make it a different color like i have mine here because you know i'm kind of dumb i get confused you want to make sure it's within the head lift of your extractor and I know the extractor says it's got a head lift of 10 meters, but I've tested it and it's actually like 31 or 32 meters tops. But just to be safe, I would put it as close to 10 meters as you can get it. Okay, now you can set your valve to zero. I have mine to zero from my key pipe going to that system and going to this system here you see the zero and it's cranked all the way to the left now the reason it's got to be within the head lift of the extractor of the new system it's helping to lift is because this side has got to be full too so that also means that you can't monkey, monkey around like have a 600 capacity pipe over here 600 mil of whatever a 600 m capacity pipe and only have like two water extractors on it because then this may not be full over here all right both sides on this valve have to be full and then you can shut it off and and it works like magic and where mine is i mean you can't even see it up there let me show you way up there and there's even a platform above that where I have my unpackages and that is high let me tell you is is where the water goes now this pipe here does not have not one pump on it and you see one two three four five this is 50 meters right here there is no way this pipe should be full without a pump. And you see there ain't no pumps on that pipe. None at all. And it's going even higher up here and around there. And the same thing over here. This one here. And I'm going to end up adding some more. You know, I can branch this Keystone pipe off anywhere I want as long as I remember to keep that valve at or below the head lift for these extractors. So I used the packagers to send my water up the first time. And it goes way up here. Now you saw there were no pumps on those pipes. Okay, at first I had this going and filling these, but now I have a valve from up top to, to cut this off because I don't want the bottle and plant filling this up anymore. I want, you know, the magic force from below filling these up, and I've got buku of these big water tanks up here because the water has to travel a long way, and I don't want no nonsense when I build my refineries and all that stuff that need water below. And here I am testing how tall they are and all that. Here's my unpackaging if you wanted to see that. One more thing you gotta know is when you're bringing your water back up, the point at which your key pipe is has obviously got to be higher than wherever you're bringing your water back up to. See, I'm bringing my water back up to here to fill all these tanks.
but my key pipe comes from up here so that's you know it's not a whole lot higher but it's higher that's that's all it is to it folks and this is a fast way down of course just falling down Make sure you fall down close enough to the electrical to fly right before you hit the ground or else you're going to regret it. 